Fisher and Stone donned a unique ensemble consisting of a sheer leopard print dress, which had one part of her midsection exposed while seemingly revealing part of her bra. The 63-year-old paired the outfit with a black overcoat draped over her shoulders while walking the red carpet in a pair of burgundy heels. Sharon was accessorized with a black Dolce & Gabbana clutch, pink hoop earrings and appeared to have opted for a radiant look in the makeup department. Other celebrities at the Hollywood movie bash included the film's stars Denzel Washington and Frances McDormand. Denzel kept things simple in a sweater and a suit matched with shoes of a similar shade, while Frances looked brilliant in a bloom printed white jacket. Her outfit included pink socks and black sandals to finalize her look for the occasion. The tragedy of Macbeth was directed by Joel Cohen, who makes his debut as a solo filmmaker, having previously helmed all of his blockbuster flicks alongside his brother Ethan. His latest flick is set for a limited release in cinemas on December 25 before being made available for streaming on Apple TV Plus from January 14. Meanwhile, in November, Sharon shared a sweet social media post as she asked fans to keep her mother, Dorothy Marie Stone, in her prayers after she had suffered an acute stroke. Say a prayer for Dorothy Marie Stone, my mom who has suffered another acute stroke tonight. THX, the Catwoman star revealed. An acute stroke occurs when blood flow to the brain is disrupted, subsequently injuring brain tissues and cells. Sharon was met with an outpouring amount of love and support from her fans and friends after sharing the news online. Fellow actress Octavia Spencer wrote, Oh no! Film director Ava DuVernay chimed in with her remark, holding her in prayer and light. TV star Kristen Chenoweth added, Prayers happening now. Getting offline to do so. Over the years, Sharon has helped raise awareness of the disease after having suffered a stroke back in 2001, which left her unable to speak and write. In a previous interview with Radio Times, the actress gushed about the incident, which left her learning how to read and write again, an experience she described as life-changing. I had a stroke and a nine-day brain hemorrhage that changed my life forever. I had a 5% chance of surviving, Sharon told the publication. When I came home after the stroke, I could barely walk. My hip was unstable. I couldn't see out of my left eye and I couldn't hear out of my left ear. According to the Basic Instinct actress, she couldn't write her name for three years and had little to no feeling in her left arm due to the dangerous medical condition. Though Sharon does not appear in the tragedy of Macbeth, she does have a lineup of projects in the pipeline for the new year, including the movies What About Love and Beauty? The Pennsylvania local most recently starred in the Kaylee Cuoco led comedy The Flight Attendant, alongside Rosie Perez, Griffin Matthews, and T. R. Knight.